In this video, we will cover the 10 most common excavation hazards. We will explore the risks of cave-ins and collapses, falls, inhalation hazards, lack of oxygen, underground utilities, vibration and noise hazards, water ingress, mobile equipment accidents, confined space, and extreme temperatures. Cave-ins and collapses. Soil instability can cause cave-ins, posing significant risks to workers. Various factors contribute to this instability, including soil type. The different soils have varying stability. Cohesive soils like clay are generally more stable than granular soils like sand, but can become unstable when exposed to water. Excavation depth. Deeper excavations increase pressure on surrounding soil, raising the risk of cave-ins. Weather conditions. Rain, snow, and freeze-thaw cycles can reduce soil stability. Nearby construction activities. Vibrations from heavy machinery can destabilize soil. Improper excavation techniques. Not following proper practices like sloping, benching, or shoring increases the risk of cave-ins. Falls. Falls are a significant outcome, particularly when workers are near the edge of an excavation or climbing in and out of it. Unstable ground, loose soil, and uneven surfaces increase the risk of slips, trips, or loss of balance. Without proper precautions like guardrails, secured ladders, and clear paths, workers face a heightened risk of serious injury. Implementing safety measures and training is essential to minimize these dangers and maintain a secure work environment. Inhalation hazards. Excavations can expose workers to dangerous atmospheres, potentially causing severe health issues or death. One major inhalation hazard is carbon monoxide, CO, a colorless, odorless gas produced by burning fuels like gasoline, propane, or natural gas. CO is especially dangerous because it bonds with hemoglobin in red blood cells, reducing the oxygen carried in the body. Lack of oxygen. Excavations can create an oxygen-deficient environment, leading to dizziness, confusion, unconsciousness, and even death. Oxygen deficiency happens when the air's oxygen concentration drops below 19.5%. Key factors increasing this risk include Displacement of oxygen. Gases and compounds in and around the trench can displace oxygen. Absorption of oxygen. Chemical processes in the trench or metal oxidation, rust, can absorb oxygen. Underground utilities. Excavation activities can accidentally strike or damage underground utilities like water, electrical, and natural gas lines, leading to severe injuries, fatalities, and property damage. Key factors increasing the risk of utility strikes include Inaccurate or outdated utility locating. Not accurately locating and marking underground utilities before excavation can cause accidental damage. Inadequate support. Excavating near utilities without proper support can lead to collapse, damage, or disruption. Emergency preparedness and response. Develop and communicate an emergency action plan that includes procedures for responding to utility strikes, such as contacting utility providers and evacuating workers. Vibration and noise hazards. Excavations that use heavy machinery create vibration and noise hazards for workers. Prolonged exposure can cause hearing loss, tinnitus, and other health issues. Key factors increasing these risks include use of heavy machinery, Equipment like backhoes, bulldozers, and excavators generate significant vibrations and noise. Exposure time. Longer exposure increases the risk of developing health problems. Vibration can also impact soil and site conditions, causing possible cave-ins or ground condition changes that might not be seen. Water ingress and flooding. Excavations can fill with water from heavy rainfall 
broken water lines, or other sources, posing drowning or electrocution hazards. Key factors increasing the risk of water ingress and flooding include Proximity to water sources. Excavations near rivers or lakes are at higher risk of flooding. Heavy rainfall. Prolonged rain can quickly fill excavations with water. Broken water lines. Damaging water lines during excavation can cause water to enter. Mobile equipment accidents. Excavations use mobile equipment like dump trucks, backhoes, and excavators, posing accident risks for workers. A major hazard is workers being struck or run over by this equipment. Key factors increasing the risk include Proximity to equipment. Workers close to mobile equipment are at higher risk. Visibility. Poor visibility from weather, darkness, or obstructions increases accident risk. Confined space. Excavations can create confined spaces with limited entry and exit, which pose significant risks to workers. Confined spaces can lead to hazards like dangerous atmospheres, entrapment, or engulfment. Key risk factors include Size of the excavation. Small or narrow excavations can become confined spaces. Lack of ventilation. Poor ventilation can result in dangerous atmospheres, such as low oxygen levels. Presence of hazardous materials. Excavations may contain harmful gases, chemicals, or fumes. Extreme temperatures. Excavations can expose workers to extreme temperatures, causing heat or cold stress, which can lead to serious health issues. Key risk factors include Exposure time. Prolonged exposure to extreme temperatures increases health risks. Environmental conditions. Factors like humidity, wind, and sunlight can affect temperature extremes. In conclusion, excavation work involves significant risks, including cave-ins, falls, hazardous atmospheres, oxygen deficiency, underground utilities, vibration, water ingress, mobile equipment accidents, confined spaces, and extreme temperatures. Addressing these hazards through proper planning, training, and safety measures is essential to protect workers. By prioritizing best practices and vigilance, excavation activities can be performed safely and efficiently.